Hey guys, what's up? Today we have arms and abs. I have a set of dumbbells, both a little bit heavier and then a lighter set. It's okay if you only have one, but you will need some kind of resistance to perform some of the exercises. If you don't, you can emulate, but you won't feel a burn really. So try to have resistance, definitely bring a water bottle. Let's go ahead and warm up with some arm circles. Going away from us, squeezing the core, squeezing the glutes. Good job, we have three, two, one. Switch sides, big arm circles coming towards the body. Good job, every single exercise is 30 seconds long. We're gonna take each one four times through. Let's go ahead and sway, alternating the arms that are on top of each other here. Great job. Good, now from here, come up, swing back, like this. Squeeze the core. Good job, our very first exercise will warm up the shoulders, get them firing and ready to go for our next one. Okay, now we're doing swimmers, so alternating the arms. Getting that T-spine involved, good job. And now go the other direction. Great work. Awesome job, okay. Shake it off, you should feel the blood flow into your shoulders now. We are gonna start in a shoulder tap. This is a body weight exercise. It's gonna be body weight for our first two exercises. What I want you to do is get into a high plank. Your thumbs will be together so your hands are together. Feet are as wide as you need them to in order not to sway. So if you do this, your core shut off. So get your feet nice and wide as if something's on your tailbone and you can't let it fall off your tailbone. Here we go. Left hand to right shoulder and switching sides. Make sure you're pausing here. If you're going fast, you're not adapting. So make sure you pause as your shoulder hits your palm. Good job making sure your hips aren't moving at all, and you're also not dropping those hips. Good job, guys. We have three, two, one, child's pose if you need it. And from here, we're going high plank, knee drive. So back into your high plank, your wrists are under your shoulders, your, uh, your wrists are under your shoulders, and we're gonna come up, bringing the leg to the chest and back. Good. Make sure you're pausing. This is not a mountain climber. Good job, guys. Awesome work. We have five, four, three, two, one. Good job. Shake it off. Grab both of your heavier weights. If you only have one weight, I'll let you know when we're halfway so you can switch. We're going to alternate here. Knees under hips, wrists under shoulders. Row up, come down. Make sure you're lowering with control. If you only have one weight, work on one side at a time. If you only have one weight, you have five more seconds before you switch. You have three, two, switch to the other side. If you have both weights, you're good. You should feel the muscles around the rib cage here. Great job, guys. And we have three, two, one, awesome work. Shake it off, we're coming to standing. Feet are in for the part, squeeze the glutes. Palms are gonna face you, elbows face forward the whole time. Squeeze the core, we're shooting up towards the sky and coming low. Your job is to make sure your rib cage is not flaring out. Keep that rib cage above your pelvis, squeezing the core. Elbows forward, good job. Lowering with control. Really squeezing that core. Awesome work. We have three, two, one. Good job, you can keep one of your heavier weights or you can grab both of your lighter weights. If you have one of the heavier weights, hold the end like this with your thumb and your pointer finger. Otherwise, both of the lighter weights overhead, we're coming down and driving up. Just like with that overhead press, Try to keep your elbows pointed forward, not flaring out. If they are, you're not hitting the triceps in the way that we want them to. If it's really hard to do it, you can keep your arms apart and then go get it at the top here. Good job. 
You should feel the muscles right below your elbow, especially when you straighten because that's their job. Three, two, one. Great work, you guys. Another tricep here. Knees stay above the heels. You're pushing the hips back. Chest is parallel to the ground as you can get it. Elbows glued to the rib cage. Palms face each other. You're going to extend and then bring it right back to your hips here. Don't curl the dumbbells up to your shoulders. Right back to the hips. Extend and come right back. Push your shoulders away from the ears. Don't let your shoulders tuck up to the ears. Great job, guys. Ten more. Awesome work. We have five, four, three, two, one. Great job. All right. So we're flat on our back for a leg lift. Hands can go under your bum to your side palms up or right behind the head. Legs stay straight. Squeeze the glutes. We're lifting, lowering with control. If this bothers your lower back, you can either bend the knees and don't go as low or alternate your legs. When you alternate and go one at a time, it takes the pressure off the lower back because of extension here. Squeeze, make sure the lower back stays on the floor. Good job, guys. We have five, four, three, two, and one. Hug your knees to your chest. Deep inhale. Exhale. Great work. Grab a drink of water. Always, always grab water. And we're doing that again. All right, guys. We have 15 seconds to get in that shoulder tap. We're practicing this shoulder tap four times. So if your hip was swaying a lot, keep working on getting it as still as possible. The only thing I see moving should be your arms. Here we go. Hands together, feet nice and wide. Hips low, squeeze those glutes. Tap, hold, then switch. Make sure you adjust your weight on the palm that's steadying you before you bring that other arm up. You should feel the lower core here firing. If you don't, you're probably swaying the hips. We have 10 more, come on. Good job, guys. Three, two, one. Try those clothes if you need it. And we're back into that high plank. Your wrists are under your shoulders. Your feet together. Squeeze your glutes as you bring your knee up to your chest. Hold. And then drive right back down. Feel the crunch that your abs are producing here. Good job. You'll feel your entire core firing. Muscles around your rib cage. Good job. The lower core fire. Keep going nice and slow. Controlled repetition. We're almost there. We got five. Three, two, one. Great work, you guys. Go ahead and grab your resistance. It's going to be the same thing here. Wrists under your shoulders, knees under hips. If your knees are closer to your hands, it's going to be really easy. Go ahead and alternate. If you only have one dumbbell, I'll let you know when we're halfway. If you find that your knees are getting closer to your um, hands, it's going to be very easy. If you have one dumbbell, go ahead and switch sides. We're halfway. The knees are under the hips or behind the hips, as long as your hips are not swaying towards the ground here. Good job. The elbows raise the rib cage here. We have three, two, one. Great work. Shake it off. Overhead press. Go ahead and grab your dumbbells. Palms face you. Squeeze the glutes in the core. Stay as stable as you can. Here we go. All the way up. Hold. Keeping that rib cage down. Lower with control. Notice at the top, my wrists, elbows, and shoulders are all in line. Even as I lower, they are on one plane here. They're not coming out and the wrist in, okay? Really work on that. If it's hard to fix, all you gotta do is stretch out your upper body a little bit more. Good job, we have five. Amazing, three, two, one, good job. And we're back to those tricep overhead. Either grab one of your dumbbells, hold it with your thumb and your pointer finger, or both of your dumbbells here. We're overhead, wrists, elbows, shoulders, all in line as you lower and lift. If you're able to keep your elbows pointed forward, go ahead and bring your dumbbells together. 
Make sure you're not arching your back so you're not here. You're here. Lower lift. Good job. Ten more. Great work. Five. Good job. Three, two, one. All right. Shake it off. Our triceps again. Feet hip width apart. Knees above the heels. Sit back. Chest parallel to the floor. Elbows glued to the rib cage. Extend. Hold. Pushing the shoulders away from the ears and come right back in. Extend. Hold. Focus on the muscles above the elbows. Here we go. Good job. Hold. And come back. We're holding for three, two, one. Maintain that tempo. You got this. Almost there, guys. Keep going. We got four. Three, two, and one. Good job. Relax. And we're back into those leg lifts. So, coming down. Great job, overhead tricep, let's do this. Whichever dumbbells you want, if you want a heavier dumbbell is bigger than your lighters, go ahead and try to progress that. Here we go. Lower, 
lift, squeezing the glutes and the core, consistently check in with your rib cage. Is it coming out in front of you? If it is, you're not benefiting yourself at all. Tuck and just go as much range as you can. Elbows forward, you got this, come on. 10 more seconds, I know it burns. Five, four, three, two, just get one more. Good job, you guys. All right, so these triceps, palms are gonna face up, sitting the hips back. Palms are facing you, we're turning them up, okay? Extend and back in. So at the top here, the palms are facing the floor. At the bottom, your palms are facing your face. Good job. Different part of the triceps here. Still a crazy burn. Check it with those shoulders. Make sure they're away from your ears. Good job, guys. Keep going. We got five, four, three, two, one. Great job, you guys. Shake it off. All right, leg lifts. Let's do this. Hands behind the head to the side or under the bum. And let's hit it. 30 seconds, lowering with control. How can you progress this? You can slow down even more as you lower. You can pause at the very bottom here. Good job, make sure that lower back is on the ground. Squeezing the glutes to get the hip flexors out of the equation. Great work, you guys. We have four, three, two, and one. Knees to chest, deep inhale. And exhale. All right, great work, you guys. We got one more round, you're killing it. Good, good job. Grab a drink of water. Hydrate those muscles. Good, good job, guys. All right, we're killing it. We have 15 more seconds for that shoulder tap. I'm really gonna emphasize the holds here. That way, we can challenge ourselves even more, really kill this round, okay? Palms together, feet as wide as you need them to be. Ready? Right hand up to that left shoulder. We're holding three, two, one. Down, switch, three, two, one. Down, switch, three, two, one. Continue that tempo, same thing, same focus. Check in with that back. Make sure you're not arching it. Your hips aren't sinking and your hips aren't swaying. Good job, we have three, two, one. Shake it off, drop into our child's pose if you need it. We're doing the same exact thing with that high plank knee drive. Opposite knee, opposite elbow. Get into that perfect high plank, here we go. Left knee to the right elbow, hold one, two, we're back. Really emphasize that crunch right here, squeeze, one, two, back. Keep switching, keep that tempo. Squeeze it on purpose, don't just go through the motions. Don't waste your time. Two, one, back. Two, one, back. Great work, you guys. Almost there, we got five, four, three, two, one. All right, shake it off. Grab your heavier dumbbells. All right, guys. So we're alternating again. Knees even farther behind you. Here we go. Elbow to rib cage. Hold. One, two. Lower with control. Drive. One, two. Lower with control. Focus on the muscles around that rib cage here. And if you only have one dumbbell, go ahead and switch. Good job. Grazing the rib cage. You should feel your core working in order to keep you from swaying from one side to the next. Good job. Awesome work. One more. And switch the other side. Good job. Go ahead and come to standing. Let's work on that tempo as well. All the way up, elbows forward. Squeeze that glute, squeeze the core. Shoot up, hold one, two, lower for three, two, one, drive. Three, two, one. Don't lower until you've got that two second pause. Where are your elbows? Are they forward? How is your rib cage? Are you squeezing that core? Good job, almost there. Great work, you guys. We have five, four, three, two, one. Great work. And triceps. 
Shake it off, guys. All right, here we go. And here we go. Lower, lift, elbows forward. Good job. Lowering with control. Staying at the top, focusing on those muscles. I know the shoulders are burning, but let's try to focus on the muscles right underneath your elbow here. Great job. We have 10. Great job. We have five. We have four. Three, two, one. All right, shake it off. Same thing, palms are gonna face up here as we hit this tricep. Knees hip width apart, sit those booties back, palms up and extend. Hold, come right back in. Hold, right back in. You got a two second hold, keeping your shoulders away from your ears. Try not to round. Keep that back straight. Good job, almost there. Awesome work, you guys. You got eight. Great job. And four, three, two, one. Great work, you guys. Let's hit those leg lifts. How can you do this better? Here we go. Start at the top. And we're lowering for three, two, hold one, two, drive. Lower three, two, one, squeeze the cheeks. One, two, drive. Lower three, two, hold, and drive. Great work, you guys. Where's that lower back? Is it against the floor? Squeeze those cheeks. Great work. Almost there. We have four, three, two, and one. Hug your knees to your chest. Deep inhale. Exhale. From here, drop both knees over to the right side. Extend your left arm. Look over your shoulder. You'll feel an incredible stretch across your lower back, all throughout the hip. Deep inhale as you relax into it. Exhale. One more. Return back to neutral. Hug your knees. And back to the other side. Extend the arm. Look over your shoulder. Two deep breaths here. One more. Hug your knees to your chest. On the exhale, go ahead and come up to standing. Interlace your hands behind your back. Lift. And if you can, let's drop it low to stretch across that chest, the biceps, the back. Tuck your chin to your chest. Keep inhale. Exhale. Sway. And thank you so much for killing it today. You really showed up. I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.